Okay, first, for sure, congratulate my players. I think they did a great job from the beginning till the end. We knew it was going to be very difficult because it's a team that plays with a lot of energy and in front of their fans, we know how difficult it is to play here. They always get that extra push from the fans. And okay, Kaminsky showed up in the first, in the first half. Game was very tight, both teams playing very good, moving the ball well, heading jumpers, but Kaminsky given extra push. That's where we were behind. We stayed focused on our game plan, and we were able then, when it looked like we were not in the game, we came back. And when we more or less had control of it, okay, control on a game that is like this is difficult, we missed an offensive rebound, the, the search slipped out of his hands, and Bonga missed a three. And it looked like we were out of the game again. But we came back, we played solid defense, and okay, Sylvain's shot was um, very difficult to defend, and um, players decide games. If Panther hits the last shot, um, this is why basketball is so authentic, let's say. Uh, very happy for the victory, knowing how difficult it is to win here, and it keeps us with our head up, looking for our spot in the standings, um, until the end, keep fighting. Thank you very much, Mr. Lasso. If you have questions, please introduce yourself. Wait for the microphone. Hello, Milos Milosevic, Hot Sport. Uh, coach, uh, congratulations on the win. Like, you know uh, how difficult it is to play around 20,000 people. Uh, I would say this was a huge shot by Francisco. Uh, what was your words? You were trailing the most. Uh, the most time. What was the words to keep your players motivated for this win? Well, I think, think uh, I think it was very important for them to tell them during the game that they're doing the things that we told them to do. Believe on the plan. Despite him, for example, Kaminsky is going to pop against Ibaka and against Brankovic and is going to take some jumpers. So he was 4-4-4. Four, four, four. Keep believing. We will solve that problem. That's a problem. And we have our solutions for that. Let's see if he keeps making, and let's see it. And okay, I remember in Munich, it was Kavoklo heading threes. But we stayed on the plan, and I think the team was very focused on that, offensively and defensively. I think we shared the ball very well during the whole game. We find the open men. Sometimes we make shots, difficult ones, some open ones. But we always had a good plan defensively and offensively. That keeps us focused on the game. At the end, you can win or lose, but as a coach, you have to be very proud of your team doing the right things most of the time. And like I tell the guys, okay, probably now I will still tell them what I think they didn't do good. But I think we did a very good, very solid performance for 40 minutes today. Thank you. Raiko, you can ask in Serbian, I will translate your question. Pitao bih ga samo, on se pre utakmice u izjavama je naglasio da se najviše plaše atmosfere i da je jedno od najtižnjih gostovanja. Među tim, njegovi igrači su bili najviše koncentrisani upravo u završenju utakmice, na kraju utakmice, kada se utakmice rešavala. Kako to komentariše i drugo, da li su ambicije Bajana bile mnogo veće pre početka prvenstva nego ovo što je danas? He has two questions. First of all, you in in your pre-game comments you pointed out that you are afraid most of the atmosphere here but uh, in the most decisive moments of the game your players kept the focus and uh, they were the most concentrated in the game how you comment on that and the second question is uh, at the beginning of the season uh, and the amb ambitions of the Bayern was, uh, were higher than your position at the stands right now, so can you give him a comment about that? Okay, uh, why for me it was important to understand the atmosphere? Because in a lot of situations we're a young team and we know how difficult it is to play. I don't need to tell them that Kaminsky is a great player, that Panther is a great player, but I need them to realize that we're playing against a great team, but also the atmosphere cannot get you out of the, out of the game. So for me, it's important that we stay focused, despite in their great team. I mean, I'm not a coach that just say, okay, we have to get through the atmosphere and game will be finished because we will be okay. No. How about if you don't stop Panther? <laughs> atmosphere won't do anything. You need to stop them. You need to play good defense to attack the right situations, play basketball. But also, you have to be over that atmosphere. And that would mean I was worried because I think it's an important part of the game. 
Second, okay, uh, for us, we have the feeling that we had a lot of games under control, but we were not able to finish him with a victory. If I would be a coach just thinking about victories, I would be very sad because I think that um, some games we deserve to win, but we didn't. I'm not stupid. If I didn't win it, I didn't win it for something. So we have to get better, but we still have a chance to, I would say in Spanish, to gain that playing position and we will fight for it until the end. Thank you. Got it? Yeah, he got it. Uh... Next one in Spanish. <laughs> Espanol? No? <laughs> okay, do you have more questions? Okay. If not, thank you so much, coach. Best thank of you. luck. Nice. Nice.